Step into 2023, where grocery shopping has taken an unexpected turn. While prices for many things seem to be dropping, the story is different when it comes to food. More than half of the major U.S. food retailers are actually increasing their prices this year, and it's a bigger jump compared to last year. Famous food companies like Procter, Campbell, Nestle, Unilever, and Coca-Cola are leading the charge planning to keep pushing prices higher despite fewer people buying their products. This has led to a debate about whether they're being fair or just trying to make more money from customers. Even well-known stores like Sam's Club and Kroger, along with discount supermarkets, are warning that the prices of essential products will go up even more later in 2023. It's a bit like a money roller coaster at the grocery store, and we're here to give you the lowdown on which stores are hiking up prices once again. 1. Aldi As the go-to destination for budget-conscious shoppers, Aldi has been a haven of affordability. However, this haven is undergoing a transformation. Prices at Aldi stores have surged by a staggering 28% since 2020. But here's where the plot thickens. Some shoppers are sharing jaw-dropping experiences of their grocery bills, skyrocketing by even more significant margins. Take, for instance, a TikTok user who meticulously compared her Aldi shopping haul from 2020 to the present day. The result? A whopping 41% increase in her total bill. Items that were once budget-friendly, like eggs, bread, peanut butter, and vegetables, have now become more costly, leaving shoppers both surprised and concerned. 2. Kroger A familiar name in the grocery world, Kroger, is facing the heat as prices spiral upward leaving customers bewildered. The heart of the matter? Fruits, such as oranges, strawberries, and blueberries, have seen unprecedented price hikes. Shoppers are expressing their frustration with statements like, this is crazy, yet there's more to this story. Kroger and Albertsons are contemplating a colossal merger worth $24.6 billion, potentially granting the combined entity a significant slice of the grocery market pie. While mergers are often met with excitement, Experts are cautioning that this one could hand too much power to the conglomerate, resulting in potentially higher prices for everyday necessities. 3. Sam's Club Joining the price hike parade is Sam's Club, an establishment known for catering to bulk buyers and savvy savers. After seven years of price stability, Sam's Club is taking a different turn by raising prices on essentials. Meats, cleaning products, canned goods, and pet supplies are all on the list for price increases, ranging from 5 to nearly 24%. For Sam's Club members, this shift means adjusting their budgets and grappling with the challenge of balancing quality and affordability. 4. Walmart, the retail titan. Walmart, a cornerstone of many households, is grappling with its own set of hurdles. In the past year, grocery prices at Walmart have surged by a substantial 22%, signaling a significant departure from its reputation for affordability. Even more unsettling, Walmart's chief financial officer, John David Rainey, has hinted at the possibility of further price hikes. The culprit? Higher costs that the company is striving to manage. With the potential of a further 10% increase in grocery bills before the year's end, consumers are left pondering the changing dynamics of their shopping routines. 5. Costco Often hailed as the realm of unbeatable deals for its members, Costco has thrown a curveball by announcing impending price hikes on various products. But what's lurking behind these increases? Let's dissect it. Consumer analyst Julie Ramhold from DealNews.com has pointed out the unexpected shifts in Costco's pricing strategy. While some hikes might be anticipated, others are catching shoppers off guard. The bakery aisle, which was once a haven of affordability, is witnessing price spikes of 7 to 12 percent on cakes, muffins, and croissants. The price dance extends to soda and carbonated beverages. And even the humble chicken is stepping onto the price increase stage with a whopping 19 percent jump. But why is chicken taking the steepest leap? It seems that the shifting focus of manufacturers and supply chain dynamics might be steering the price surge. Maple syrup and breakfast cereals have also joined the race of rising prices. Interestingly, even if the price of wheat drops, it might not necessarily translate into a decrease in cereal prices, which paints a broader picture of economic complexities. 6. Little Echoing its sibling Aldi, Little is undergoing a transformation of its own, though it's not all sunshine and savings. With an impressive network of around 240 stores in the U.S., Little is becoming a battleground for double-digit price hikes across an array of products. The spotlight has shifted to an concerned Little worker, 
who is shedding light on the concerning price increases. The chatter among shoppers is growing louder as they find themselves grappling with weekly price hikes that are hitting hard. From a 30-cent surge in store-brand sausages in a single week to a shift from single-digit changes to increments of 10 cents, the affordability that once defined little is slowly eroding. 7. Trader Joe's Picture the Hawaiian-themed aisles of Trader Joe's now embroiled in a storm of price increases. This beloved grocer, known for its unique charm, is facing criticism for pushing up prices across a range of product categories. The shift is felt keenly in leafy greens like cabbage, organic shredded kale, and organic Caesar salad, which have seen a notable uptick in prices. While these hikes might range from 20 to 30 cents, they still translate to a substantial 5 to 15% increase from the original cost. But the price surge doesn't stop there. It extends to items like milk, butter, yogurt, and even meat selections such as ground beef patties and ribeye steak. 8. Whole Foods Emerging as a premium destination for foodies, Whole Foods is wrestling with its own set of challenges. As foot traffic and sales dip, the company is urging its suppliers to lower their costs. However, within the past year, Whole Foods raised prices on various packaged food brands, signaling a delicate balance between maintaining profit margins and customer loyalty. The tale unfolds as the second half of 2023 approaches, with fruits, nuts, grains, and vegetables poised to experience additional price hikes within Whole Foods stores. 9. HEB, the Lone Star State's beloved grocery chain, HEB has found itself at the center of a controversy sparked by extreme price hikes. The online community is buzzing with frustration as consumers point out drastic price increases on store-made products. One Reddit user questioned HEB's justification for a 32% price increase on its store brand Polios in just a few months. This increase has led some shoppers to change their habits with their grocery bills ballooning unexpectedly. Matters have escalated to the point where shoppers have taken legal action against HEB, alleging price gouging for essentials like eggs. This legal battle underscores the real-world impact of rising prices on everyday life. 10. Safeway Joining the ranks of grocery chains facing legal challenges, Safeway is in the spotlight for its misleading promotions and aggressive price increases. In a lawsuit filed against the chain, Customers claim that Safeway inflated prices on items included in buy one, get one free and similar promotions, leaving them questioning the concept of a free product. This legal action draws attention to the deceptive practices and their impact on nearly a million customers in California alone. Safeway's prices remain 16% higher than Walmart's and the absence of price matching has left consumers wrestling with high costs across a range of products. Let us know your thoughts in the comments below. If you found this video engaging and informative, don't forget to hit that like button and subscribe for more thought-provoking content. Stay tuned as we continue to delve into the intricate tales that shape our world today.